Hi guys, my name is Maria and I'm from Audacious, Manchester, Central Location. And today I would like to encourage you with a verse from Ephesians 3.20 which says God is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, above of what we can think, dream or imagine. I love this verse because it shows that God is not limited to our thoughts, not even to our dreams. He can do so much more than that. Seven years ago, my fiance and I were studying in a Bible college in Sydney, Australia and were completely financially broke as a Bible college student. We literally struggled to pay our rents in the places that we stayed and had to trust God for food. Because of our financial situation, we were postponing our wedding for a little while. However, in 2015, August, we decided that it was finally time to get married and that we should not look to our natural circumstances, but trust that God is going to provide the wedding for us. We planned the wedding in six weeks time. We had more than 300 people attending, around 50 volunteers that helped to make everything happen. Our outfits were given for us. We went to a luxurious honeymoon in Bali and had seen so many miracles in that season. In the natural, we couldn't afford anything. We literally had zero in our accounts, no family that could help. However, God is a supernatural God. And in that season for me, the biggest miracle was actually receiving my wedding dress. It was three weeks till the wedding and I still didn't have a wedding dress. And in Australia, you actually have to order your dress six months in advance and it costs at least a couple of thousand dollars. By that time, three weeks till the wedding, I actually had $500 that I could use on a dress. And I started calling the shops asking if they had any sales, if they had, and what was the starting price for the sale. I found two shops from the huge list that I called that had sales and the starting price for the sale was $500, the amount that I had. To be fair, I wasn't expecting much of those dresses as they were, you know, the cheapest thing on a sale. However, I booked appointments with those two shops knowing that I actually need to get my, my dress either way. However, the day before the appointments, I was serving on team and one leader that was serving together came to me and asked how was the wedding planning and if I got my dress. I told her that not yet and the plan was to get it the next day to which she replied that she actually had a new wedding dress in her house that she bought when one shop got bankrupt and she thought she would sell it online in her online shop. However, she told me that she, even though it was her idea to sell it, she never had peace about it so she actually never sold it. And she had this new Australian designer's dress that was featured in a fashion show as the main dress of the fashion show that she said if it would fit me and if I like it I could just have it. She lived halfway to the shops that I booked the appointments so my friend and I the next day drove to her house I tried on the dress and guys it fitted me perfectly it was my size my length and I love how much into detail God is. We planned our wedding colors to be golden and silver and the top of the dress, depending on the light, it looked either golden or silver. She told me then that the dress, the original price of the dress was $20,000 but I could just have it for free. And today guys, if you find yourself in a situation where in the natural, it seems like there is no way. If you are waiting for a person if you're believing for salvation and family, if you need that healing to come and you just receive the really bad prognosis, if you are praying for the house and you can't see a way out of how you're gonna get it, just know that God is a supernatural God. He can do exceedingly, abundantly, above of what we can think, dream, or imagine. Have a blessed day, guys. Bye.